hello guys welcome back to this channel in this video we want to see uh, how to request eth for doing specifically a thin parthenon testnet so uh, a thin network is actually uh, nearing its main net so testnet has already begun i did a video on how to withdraw a thin network token to metamask so we all did that so when you open your metamask uh, so make sure by the time you do you're requesting for eth you have already uh, uh added uh, a thin parthenon here okay so let me uh, change the network to a thin parthenon a thin blockchain okay so this is a thin parthenon so make sure you have already gotten here so now when you add this you're going to realize that you have two tokens here we have ethereum and we have a thin network okay so now my point of interest is this we are supposed to request for ethereum for testnet okay remember we are actually uh, practicing on how a thin network how a thin blockchain is going to be working uh, once uh, it goes mainnet so that is the reason why we are actually participating in testnet so we want to request our eth that is ethereum for uh, a thin network and then get ready for testnet okay so what do you need to do first of all go to the browser section so once you go to the browser section uh, on the search section uh, come and write a thin scan dot io a thin scan it should be one word a thin scan dot io uh, a thin let me write a thin scan dot io let's search that and see where it's going to take us to a thin scan yes so it's going to take you to this particular page so the next thing you need to do tap on connect wallet the option of connect wallet is right here so click on connect wallet and then choose your metamask all right it's going to prompt you to connect then tap on connect okay so it has already connected you'll be able to see your address appearing up up there then scroll down a bit uh, and by the way if you have not added eth to the wallet you can just tap on uh, add to wallet and it's going to be adding it as you can see uh, mine is already added and i have some balance there so there is no need of adding again so we are going to scroll down here to where you see eth then you tap on request okay so you see they say the faucet request was registered successfully and the transaction has appeared here they have showed the address where they have sent the faucet to the amount they have sent is 0 0.004 uh, ethereum for testnet and the status currently it is pending <clears throat> so in the next few minutes i think i should be able to receive it in the wallet and once the testnet now goes live and we start uh, practicing doing transactions we are going to be uh, we are going to uh, know exactly how this works now every 24 hours if you wish to get more ethereum for testing purposes you can actually uh, use the same procedure uh, and request again and again you will be getting 0 0.004 ethereum for every request okay so I think that is it uh, that ethereum is going to be reflecting here shortly so that is actually all that you need to know all right so make sure you follow everything to the end uh, and as you can see here they are actually done with private testnet uh, we are actually on parthenon uh, a thin parthenon testnet so after this we are actually going live on mainnet and remember ATH is currently trading about about 0 0.8 dollar 0 0.9 dollar there about in Athex exchange so that means this project could actually pay off for those people who took a thin network seriously okay so all the best as you follow all this uh, procedure to get started uh, I'll be keeping you uh, updated on this so make sure you have joined our telegram channel and uh, of course you have also subscribed to our youtube channel so that anytime we upload any video you are going to be notified all right so thank you very much I'll be seeing you in the next video